We came to Agape through um, the, the adoptive uh, parents program. We adopted Chloe, who's our uh, granddaughter, uh, in August of last year. And she came to us with, to us, some invisible needs. Chloe's always been a very loving person, but she's had a lot of things happen to and her to her that were inflicted by other people. Agape is become a very big part of my life. It's the thing that I look forward to all week or like, you know, because I love, you know, the horses and the people that like I get to um, work with. This program has brought her out of a shell, has made her recognize that she is somebody, that she can do things that she didn't think she could do, and that she can be loved by people. Without Agape, I probably wouldn't be as outgoing or as happy as I am now. I don't think that, you know, life, I would like life as much as I do now. Two things come to my mind in, in terms of what she's learned uh, as a writer, uh, someone who's being served, and as a volunteer, someone doing service. As a writer, she uh, is constantly encouraged by the staff to to reach out to do more than she thinks she could do. I'm not sure it's even the writing, but the experience of having something that you didn't think you could do well, and then finding out that through encouragement and kindness uh, and patience that you can accomplish things you never thought you could do. As far as service, I'm going to relay a story. Maybe our second week here, now parents watch through the big windows when the kids are inside and we sit next to each other and chat. On one occasion, Chloe was walking next to, uh, to the horse uh, with the, with the uh, young lady in, in saddle. And the young lady reached down and took Chloe's hand. I turned to the dad who had, had a tear and said that her whole life he's never seen that girl actually reach out to take somebody's hand other than his. And I think it's because Chloe has the capacity to love. And that's something you can't write down, it has to be felt. Uh, and that to me was an amazing thing.